Welcome to another video and in this video we're gonna take a look at how we can make this undercar shadow appear in here without using the ambient lighting. So to demonstrate that this shadow will work without ambient lighting I'm gonna go into my hierarchy and I'm just gonna disable the directional light. And now as, as we can see nothing else has shadows except for this vehicle. Now the way this works is that it's a simple plane with a mesh renderer and a simple PNG picture. So what we're going to do in this video is demonstrate how we can make this PNG image into this material and then put it underneath our vehicle. So we're going to start up with a blank image into Photoshop or whatever you might be using. We're going to disable the layer and we're going to draw in and we're going to draw in a simple rectangle. What we're going to do with this afterwards is we're going to select these blending methods. And the one we're interested in is this drop shadow. Now the reason why we need this is because we want to make this seamless. So it looks like it's actually emitting shade. So down in the drop shadow we want to obviously make it spread a little bit more. Okay, that's about it. Now we do have a little bit of a hard shadow in here, which we can fix with the opacity. So we bring the opacity down as much as we need to, and then we can apply. The next thing and the only thing that we're gonna need in our 3D modeling software is a simple plane to place it underneath our vehicle. So we're gonna drag a simple plane, we're gonna go into top view, and then we're gonna just scale it to the size of our vehicle. It obviously doesn't have to be perfect. And after you place it underneath your vehicle, you're simply gonna drag in your shadow material and drop it inside. And now we're gonna see it casts a shadow. It looks like a real shadow. And then just simply take this plane and export it into Unity. Okay, here is the plane that we just imported. It already has the material, but we're gonna make our own material. So just make sure it's properly placed underneath your vehicle and here is the material that we made we got our shadow into the material and we got the material as a transparent surface so now all that's left to do is drag the material and drop it inside and now we got ourselves a nice shade okay here is how our game looks with the shadow underneath our vehicle and that's it i hope you enjoyed it and i'll see you in the next videos